nosy neighbors, a crabby boss, Squidward needed to leave this town. So Squidward packed his clarinet and for days could not be found. His crusty friends were so upset. But what's that sound? That nasal sound? Wait a minute, turn around, says Squidward's back. Squidward back with his very own show. And this time, it's all about the squid. He's gonna teach an art class, take a bubble bath. Shake his head to cold. Take another bubble bath. Happy days with the crusty crab. Hey there, squid, you're looking totally fab, said Squidward's back. It's all in the red. Squidward's back. I heard that. Squidward's back. Oh, and cheese. Squidward's back. Pineapple. Squidward's back. Yes, that is. Squidward's back. Squidward. 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 Squidward's back. Okay, that's enough. Now, before we begin with the episode, I have to warn you, it is very, very sad. And SpongeBob. Gee, Squidward sounds like he's doing something important. Well, I'm not getting his road. Hey, Squidward. No. No. Hey Squidward. 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 Come on in. It all started back in 1977. My father was going after war, though I hadn't realized yet. I soon got the hint that I wouldn't be seeing him for a long while. Daddy! <laughs> Hello? Why are you the... Huh? Dad. <laughs> all right, all right, I'm up. Another day, another migraine. Oh, yeah, can I get a. Um, huh? A crummy patty. Uh huh. With an uh, extra cup. Wait a minute. Where have I heard that voice before? Yeah, huh? Son? Wow, I haven't seen you in such a long time. Well, it all started back in war, when I realized that millions of lives were at risk. So rather than taking theirs, I took mine. Luckily, I landed right next to a trampoline and clothing selection. 
So, rather than dying, I crashed right next to a new house. Apparently it hadn't been sold yet, and it was for free. Meanwhile, my wife found out the hard way. Her husband was supposedly dead. And that's how I, out of a pity self-act, had made me look like the worst person in the world. <laughs> Will you ever forgive me, son? I'm just glad that you're okay.